After sitting through reviews like that, Emma's prepared to do almost anything to knock off the years, which is spookily close to what we have planned for her. It's going to be a team effort. Today, guys, we have Emma. She's 35 years old, but the poll thinks she looks 40, which means we've got to make her look 30. She's got really heavy bags under her eyes. Her skin tone is grey and sallow, which is made worse by the fact that her hair, Nikki, is appalling. That's going to be fun. I'm going to bring her in now. Let me know what you think. Jan. Jan Stanek is one of the UK's leading cosmetic surgeons and an expert in facial rejuvenation. I think the most striking thing that I see from my point of view is her eye bags yep. and rather overactive forehead. And Jan, what can we, can we do about those bags and the overactive forehead? Well, eye bags are fairly easy to treat. So I would make an incision on the inside of the eyelid. Right. And obviously it's a scarless operation. And the effect would be something like this. Hmm. Look Amazing. at that. Amazing. Makes quite a, bit of, quite a bit of difference. As far as the forehead is concerned, I think the best thing for it is Botox. Thanks, Jan. Thank you. Nikki, do you want to have a look? Nikki Clark is just about everybody's first choice for a hairstylist. I mean, there's an awful lot going on here in terms of um, some of the colour and some of it's been done quite crudely. The, uh, the kind of shape, it's something that is, is much more suited to a, uh, an older woman. Mm. It's in fact quite ageing. The cut itself is, is slightly all over the place because we've got sort of short bits sitting disconnected mm. next to parts that are very long and also very straggly. I think that my brief primarily is to make it younger and a little easier. Brilliant. It's going to be That's good. great. Thanks, Nikki. Ruby. Ruby Hammer's a makeup artist who's glammed up the good, the bad, and from time to time, the ugly. I was quite shocked, actually, to hear her age. And um, in a way, there's things you can do with makeup that can slightly, you know, add a bit of a youthful yeah. bloom to herself. But the bags are quite scary because you see sometimes when you camouflage those with makeup you can accentuate them. The other thing is I don't think Emma's really taken good care of her skin because it's, it's not bad but it's it's just it hasn't got that glow. No, it hasn't got that. year old has yeah. that fresh. So I think when shine. we use cosmetics on I'd like to not apply so much that it masks it so that she looks older again just to try and give that bloom back. Mm. She does need our help. Mm. I'm shocked to say that. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Thank, Thank you, you Ruby.